Hey guys, been again with another YouTube video. I just finished up doing a live stream where we built this beauty, the Mark 20 SSR Master Edition, uh, with its epic Arctic camouflage. But that is not the focus of today's video. Today's focus is on the FN Herstal P90 Master Edition, another FNH weapon that we uh, created on live stream a while back, but. I'm sorry about the quality of this image. Uh, the program that I had to use to render this is Blue Render, uh, which is some program that's worse than um, LDD to Pavre and then Pavre itself. And the reason I had to use Blue Render is because Pavre, for some reason, is acting up. And Blue Render's metallic colors, the ones that have a metallic sheen to them, have this weird effect on it, this weird grainy effect, so I apologize for this, but this is without a doubt still a rendered image of the FN Herstal P90 uh, in its form, so you can see the proper color, the blue right about here, the white a little bright, and then the black, actually a dark black color. Uh, but this is what it looks like inside of LDD, a much much cleaner looking model and an absolutely adorable adorable camouflage i love the, the just cleanness to this camouflage i don't know what it is about it but it just looks so so good i love the way it looks not much to say back here about the stock it's just a stock we have the two white stripes going down through it real simple we have the base blue metallic kind of uh, sand blue color going throughout the entire model going on right now we have the wire harness here. And before I go any farther, I just realized what I wanted to say. Uh, I got some channel art done up here at the top. And then I also reorganized the playlists and everything so that you have uh, my uploads here, the Lego gun models here, Lego gun live streams down here, and then you have the N4 PDW instructions up here. So uh, I did do some uh, organization of the homepage and everything so yeah that is that is going so just quick little detour but we have a harness back here the FN Herschel P90 is notorious for not having any uh, available sling attachment points so you can put on a harness which is what this black wraparound thing is called so that you can have a sling attachment point here right up here we have our ambidextrous magazine release just pull it back and then it comes out of our large 50 round magazine here. As you can see we have a fully loaded double stack magazine and through the weapon itself. Shout out to Bakker, he's the one who uh, inspired me to do this kind of uh, design while on stream. So thank you Bakker, that's really appreciated because it made this line down here look real clean. And if LDD wasn't dumb, then it would make this here look real clean as well. But the tip of the bullet right here blocks out uh, the ability to put in a, a plate through there, even though a plate can go there. So thanks, LDD. Real, real proud of you. Take a look up here. You can see the shell ejection port and then the bolts up here, which is connected to the charging handle up front. So you can, in fact, pull this back and then uh, see the magazine through here. So if we go through and kind of hide some of the pieces to our magazine here, you'll see the top of the bolt. And then this is the point where the magazine release comes into the weapon itself. And then if you hide the bolt itself, you can see through to the bottom of the weapon so you can in fact uh, charge the weapon properly like it should be down here we have the ergonomic grip the staggered sides so that it feels more rounded in the hand the safety This side over here is for uh, safe, and this side 
over on the other side is for fire. And the P90 works off of something called a two-stage trigger. If you pull it halfway, it fires semi-automatically. And then if you pull it all the way, it fires fully automatically. We have up here the ambidextrous charging handle. One side over here and the other side over here. And these plates are turned sideways, by the way. So you can uh, see how I did this part of the weapon, basically. Just turn those bricks sideways. The front foregrip, which acts as part of the trigger guard. The barrel and muzzle brake. And then the top rail section up here with the iron sights off of the CUDA, which are just really, or, or not the CUDA, uh, the uh, crap, what's called the MP5K. Three star wide. Tactical grill up on top of here, and then all the necessary sloping so that this model looks absolutely fantastic. So this is, in fact, the FN Hostel P90 Master Edition. I just wanted to put out another gun video for you guys. I got plenty of gun videos. Trust me, there's all sorts of different models that I need to do and whatnot. But uh, I wanted to get this video out because I also wanted to show you guys that I did, in fact, do the the homepage, especially the channel art up top of here. Real simple channel. Really like how it uh, goes and works and whatnot. So, plus the playlist down here, so you can watch all the uh, gun models and the live streams. I gotta add this to the gun models playlist and then the uh, Mark 20 SSR to the live streams playlist. But we will get there eventually. So thank you guys so much for watching. Remember comment and subscribe for more videos similar to this one. I'll see you guys later in another YouTube video. All of that wonderful jazz.